Good morning, all my beautiful people. It seems like it's going to be a beautiful day. A little bit of pink and gray in the sky. And I'm gonna get ready and I'm gonna make a quick pudding and then I'm going to go out thrifting. Come along. I'm going to make um, a chocolate pudding out of cottage cheese. So it's just cottage cheese. Um, I did about a cup and a half. I'll do about a teaspoon of um, maple syrup and about a tablespoon of um, cocoa powder. And I buy the Friars one, but it doesn't matter which one you buy, but that's what I use. And you blend it all together till it's smooth and then you put it in the fridge for a few hours. It's like chocolate pudding. A tablespoon of cocoa powder and then I'm gonna put a drizzle of real maple syrup in it. Ah, about a teaspoon, not much more than that. You don't need it, it's, you don't need to be too sweet. That's about enough. And then blend that all together till it's smooth and that's it, that's all. Now I could add more cocoa to make it darker, but it tastes just like, I just tasted it. it. Tastes exactly like chocolate pudding. And it's high protein, way better for you. And easy to make, three ingredients. This is three and a half hours later and I just tried it, it's lovely. Gotta try it guys. I could have put a little more syrup and a little more cocoa, but I just don't need it. But you could if you wanted to. I'm just gonna run into the dollar store here first. I need a couple hair clips and some peroxide. Okay, I'm at the Value Village. And if you can believe it, there's snowflakes coming down. It's not really snowing, but it was so beautiful. Like 18 and now today's like five. I don't get it. Spring. While we're here, Lori met me up. That's cute. I know it's from a candle, but it's cute. I like the glass on it. If you were making candles, that'd be a good one to buy. Isn't that pretty? Yeah. That could be nice at Christmas. Um, I'm looking for some knobs for my sister. I need 22 of them. Mm-hmm, I know, but it can happen. Oh, look at this little close. Different. It's not worth $5, though. Made it and gave Lori a coupon and me a coupon, so we get 20% off today because it's not cheap day to day. But I gave us both a coupon. Gotta have our coupons, eh, Lori? I've been trying to lose a few pounds for my trip, and Lori noticed right away. I'm down like six or seven pounds, but I got, I want to lose another 10 at least. Yeah. Because I'm going to gain it, you know. I'm going to be with my sister and her friend, and we're going to be eating good food like lasagna. She made homemade. She made uh, Spanish pita. She's made Nanaimo bars, you know, sister things. So, memory lane things, you know, when you're childhood, childhood memory things, maybe, I guess you'd say. So, we're going to have a nice time together, but. I figured we'll be having a food fest. See if there's any nice picks really quick and then I'm gonna go look at knobs. We'll see. It's nice and quiet in here this morning. Uh, Lori met me at my value village. We we're gonna go to her, um, not Goodwill, St. Vincent uh, one by her house, but she wanted to come this way, so it's all good. She brought me my picture. It's all good works for me too and uh, she brought me a gift but I haven't opened it yet early Easter birthday she said that's kind of cute for Christmas isn't it okay no great pictures just met this little girl in the thrift shop and I had this in my car I, I bought it at Value Village and I was gonna wasn't using it so I was gonna return it and she's collecting tear-ups for her little studio she's um I think piercing studio or something yeah piercing studio <laughs> anyways she's such a sweetheart Lori's looking like this Lori like a mirrored one this one could be 6.99 so minus 20 percent okay it's cute I used to have one similar you could paint it mine's go mine was gold I think I have one. That's what I'm talking about. Ah, sexy times. Where'd you see it? it was just let me see. Let me see. How much? 
seven. Why so Needs much? Needs a little screw up, but it's okay. Oh, this kind of like beautiful. mine. That is nice for Easter. $12.99. But I would put my teas in that. Lucy. No, I have them in a in a milk glass. Box. Everything I think, even if it's ornate, I think it's a bird. <laughs> Crazy girl. No little trinkets today for me. And there's no this. knobs today. And Lori's in Mexico doing the shaking the shaking her booty. She's going to Mexico. Yeah. Or not Mexico, Spain. Well, anyway, yeah, I hear you. I'm the same. You give me music. I hardly ever watch TV, and I have a YouTube channel. Mm, I found a little box. I'm not 100% sure on it. It's my style for sure. It's brass and silver, and of course, it's got a lion on it. It's kind of neat. There's a little piece in the back missing, though, and I don't know what it's from. Like, back there. But it could be cool for, like storing things in like I need more storage <laughs> just talking myself into it everybody a cute little Venetian uh, or whatever you call it Italian tray and these shadow boxes are really really nice pretty princess I have so many shelves now that I'm not using this is really pretty if you painted it out the rose with the shelf Lori should get it I think it's nice Lori I like, Lori. I like that too that one's nice too yeah, they're all nice. I like the gold one too. Not very often you see gray porcelain china. It's a sugar, or a sugar bowl, but... Oh, they do have the creamer. They have both. There you go. But it's not very often you see that. Well, this would be good for salt and pepper by the stove. I already have them, but if somebody else needed it... This is what I would use it for. We found this set, the cream and sugar and the and the coffee or tea. I think it's coffee. It's bigger, so it might be coffee, whatever. Uh, we found the set, so we put it together because that's how people buy it together. Look at this. It's called um, something ivory. Wellington ivory or something. Imperial ivory. Imperial ivory. There's four um, dessert, four sandwich, and four teacups. Beautiful little set, isn't that? Pretty princess tea party. Yeah, six times and have pretty princess. Oh my goodness, Royal Dalton Bunnikin. It's a little wrecked there, but it's so cute. I love Royal Dalton. And this is nice too. But I'm running out of room in my kitchen. I need a bigger kitchen. How much is this one? $5.99. Oh, there's lots of little trinkets. It was so nice to meet that little girl and give her my little chair. It's weird that I had it in the car. I was going to give it to um, Salvation Army, and I just stuck it in the back seat. Oh, this is a little cast iron. Oh, it doesn't have the handle, though. They're great to have. If you had a, two of them, would be fabulous. It's Napoleon, too. Oh, that's a really good brand. They make Napoleon up in Barrie, where I'm going to my cousin's, where my cousin lives. Handle's missing. If it wasn't missing, I would consider it. But how are you going to pick it up, right? I guess you could use a glove, but... These napkins are really nice. I think they're Pottery Barn. Be nice at Christmas, probably. And then I was thinking these, there's 10 of them, and we could do the bunny thing with it at my cousin's house for Easter. Her theme's kind of blue, but I think blue and green go great together myself. So I'll show you like that. I love it together. Um, she uses paper napkins, but I like cloth. I just think they're nice color too, like the Kelly green. I'm on the fence. I don't know, there's not even a price on these ones. Okay, I scored at the other Value Village. I got a little marble table with a brass stand. Lori found it as we were walking out and it was only ten dollars minus twenty percent so it was eight dollars heading into this one on Rogers Road now exactly that out of distress exactly honey yeah I wish my horsey pictures would appear again but that's okay they're not meant to be anyways I found some little pheasants for Thanksgiving that I don't need 
And I'm gonna look at these for something, but I'm just, I'm not 100% sure on them yet. I'm just gonna try something on top of them, and if it works, maybe then it's a yes, and if it doesn't, it's a no. Let's see what they have in the little candle section. Those ones are nice. Yes, honey. Okay, I'm with one of my subscribers, Nicole. Hi. She lives in the neighborhood, right? Yes. Yeah, and she's with her daughter, Leah. Pretty name, right? Yeah. We just met here. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. Okay, I am going to take a cruise. I, I'm finding stuff. I'm just putting it in my cart. Not sure what I'm getting yet. You know the drill. I love that my subscribers thrift too. It's wonderful. Oh, look at these. It's pretty Italian. Ooh. This is really beautiful. It's cracked, but it's on a wooden board. I really like it. I don't even mind that it's cracked. And if this wasn't, I would buy it for my sister's chicken coop. She's got art in her chicken coop. It's so cute. I haven't been videotaping in here because the music's really loud. It's just instrumental right now, so I might get away with it. So that's why I'm just not being rude to you guys. Not showing you. I'd love to. Okay, the commercial's on now. I'm looking for a really nice kind of Easter tablecloth to take to my cousins. She has a few, but um, I don't know what they're called. If I could find something that's, you know, pretty for Easter. It's totally adorable. If it wasn't that big, I'd take it to my sister for her chicken coop to hang stuff in. Isn't it cuter outside of, outside in the garden or something? On a greenhouse. Something. It's too big to take, though. I'm going to take a look at the jewelry here. I got a few things in my basket. I know I don't even need them. I'm going to sit and think about it while I'm looking at jewelry, what I really want. I might get the pheasants because they look like, you know, very Ralph Lauren. For, de for decorating different seasons, I can stick them in the cupboard that I don't have any room left in. Ha ha. Going to the Salvation Army now, our last store. So I got a few good things today. Oops. Thank you. Thank you, honey. Check this out. Music's always on in here, too. But if I find anything, I will totally show you. I wonder if my sister would like that with some candles in it for her coffee table or her mantle. I don't know if she'd like it. It's not real antlers. Bowl full of cherubs here. I think it's on a Christmas tree. Hold on. Music's off for a minute. I don't know how much they are. 99 each, 99 cents each. I've been to a lot of thrift stores with music, but this one's like you're in a nightclub. The commercial's on right now though. The, the old man's like, I didn't want to go to the club. I would have. I was laughing. Was, but it is very loud in here. But I'm just going to take a quick spin. I only have like nine minutes left or something on my meter. Had to pay for a meter to this one. Isn't that pretty? Pretty little vase, isn't it? Well, I dropped Lori off and I'm going in to see if there's any nice salmon today. And then I'm going to call it a day, I think. Or I'm going to go home and make myself something nice to eat for dinner. But that's it. Maybe I'll get a cart. Look what they're setting up. The garden center. Casa Loma. Pretty princess. I just want to show you guys this beautiful home here on Austin Street. Look how pretty they did the flowers. Love it love my neighborhood houses around Casa Loma that one's pretty too isn't it this one here's got way too many trees but I think they got someone in here moving some of them this house here is beautiful too and it's kind of snowing out but it's real pretty out it's just nice to be out beautiful house this is just up the street from Casa Loma this one it's gorgeous though I stopped and got a few groceries I got my hair things are usually like four dollars for um two and they were eight but i got them anyways because i need them i picked up a mayonnaise because it was on sale for five um a little peroxide some hot chili sauce because i like it cilantro limes lemon thing of sour cream cottage cheese was on for 2.99 i had a coupon for a dollar fifty so that was a deal all day long 
the bag of shrimp was on sale. I think it's 31 to 43 shrimp for $10. And then I got two different cold cuts, um, a smoked meat and a ham. The ham I'm probably gonna freeze for like eggs benedict and stuff. And I didn't need the raisins and the almonds, but they were on sale for $5 each. So I got them and they also gave me a thousand points. This was on sale for $7. So I grabbed one, I don't even need it, but I grabbed it. And then I got a pack of chicken, five chicken breast. So that's all I got for the grocery store. Not a lot, but just, I only went in for the lemons and limes and the sour cream. And I ended up buying all the other stuff. <laughs> but mayonnaise was on sale. Used to always be that price, but now it's like $8. So I thought, let me grab one. I don't need it yet, but I'll grab it anyways. And I do want the chili sauce. I make these little dumplings. And it's also really good just on pasta if you don't feel like cooking. It's very good. At the thrift store, I got this little... It was off, obviously, a dish or something. But I'm going to use it as a riser. And it was $2.49. I got a mortar and pestle, $6. And I got two of these birds. I left the other one in the car. It needs a little touch up here, but no big deal. I thought they're very Ralph looking and they'll look great um, in my fall decor. I got a parcel, I believe it's from one of my subscribers. I haven't opened it yet, but I will. And this is the picture I got Lori to pick up for me. I'm gonna change the frame, I don't like it at all, but I have a frame, I think. And it was $6.99, I think I gave her $8. That would have covered with the tax, or she probably had a senior's discount, so worked out good. And I'm looking for something a little more equestrian, but you know I like my castles and stuff, and churches and stuff always look pretty, right? And the score of the day was this table. I don't know where I'm putting it yet, but it was $10 minus uh, 20%. So it's marble and brass. So finally something got marked properly at Value Village. I just set it there for now. I am gonna clean it up. I'm also making something in my frame here, but I haven't got around to it yet, but I'll get there. I also got a gift from Lori. I don't know what it is yet. I didn't want to open it because she said it was fragile and we were in the car. I got a Value Village stuck, sticker stuck to me. So I'm gonna open it and then I'll show you. I absolutely love it, Lori. She knows I like this shape plate because it's a perfect portion size for single people. And then this is a small like sandwich plate to match. As you see, I have one here. And she got me these ones with roses on it. So pretty. Oh, I love it, Lori. And then she got me a teacup and it's polka dotted. It's very cute. And this picture I have loved forever. She has two pictures that I love. One's the bird and one's this little girl. And she gave it to me and I love the frame. Oh, you didn't have to do that. I love it. It's beautiful. So pretty princess. Thank you so much. What a beautiful gift. This is my Easter birthday gift. I got a parcel for one of my subscribers, M Milana from Acro Akron, Ohio up and I'll show you guys. Thank you so, so much. I haven't even seen it yet, but thank you very much. This video is going to be posted in April and I know you sent it on the 13th, but today is the 26th here and I received it, but um, I have another post coming up on the 31st. So anyways, I apologize that I'm, um, I'm going to look to see if I can find you and my uh, subscribers and then maybe I can contact you that way. Hold on everybody. She sent me a card and it's got a little bumblebee on it. It's so cute. It's a beautiful card. Thank you so much. It says, keep doing what you're doing. Awesome. Be happy, Milana. Beautiful. And her puppy, Rena, Rena, Reno. Aw, so beautiful. And then she sent me a little special note. And it said, sorry, this took so long to get to you. I was thrifting and decided you had to have it. I uh, love your channel. You're my, f uh, love my channel. My French bulldog watches with me. Oh, it's from our little French bulldog, like my little Hendrix. Happy spring. Have a awesome day. You're fabulous. Oh, what a beautiful lady. Look at the little lady in the dress. I love it. So vintage. Let's see what we got here. She, like she spent a fortune to send this to me. $46. 
That's crazy. Oh, a cream bee mug. Oh, I can have my coffee in it every morning. Thank you so much. Well, how sweet. Like, that's beautiful. Like, I have the best subscribers. I really do. Thank you so, so very much. I really appreciate it. I got presents from Lori, presents from you. I feel real like a queen today, for sure. Thank you again so very much. I hope I can find you on my subscriber list so we can chat. <laughs> if not, please email me at brookdraycott4 at gmail.com and we can chat that way. Thank you again. You spent a fortune mailing this to me, you silly woman, you. But I really appreciate it. Thank you. I'm just washing up all my little presents and my cup here. Thank you again so, so much. I'm going to move my bunny picture back into the pantry because that's where it was. I think I'm going to frame this one. I'm not sure if I'm putting it over here with the horse yet or if I'm putting it here. Not sure because I took down my Alvaro Alta one and I see it's got splashes all over it from the sink. Um, and I might put it back underneath there. Haven't figured that one out yet, but I'll get there. See what I'm doing. And uh, I think that's it for now. I'm just going to clean this marble table too. I'm going to give it a really good scrub. Really have no idea where I'm going to put this yet. But I just washed it. I wish I had marble countertops now that I see this. Figure it out. And when I do, it's not going to be today when I figure it out. Because I'm stripping my living room apart. Probably tomorrow or the next day, I'm taking everything out, scrubbing everything down, taking the slip covers off the sofa, washing them, and then, yeah. Put the, well, it's really not a riser, but I'm using it for when I put it underneath this little ginger jar. It's a little too silver for in here, but I got some gold rub. So I bought it when I was in LA. So I'm going to put some of that antique rubber. I can't think what it's called. Rub and buff? Rub and buff. There you go. Sorry. They don't sell it in Canada anymore. I'm going to probably rub some of that on. Not today, but I will. And I haven't figured out where my table's going. And my picture I got is use you the frame up. My Alvaro also one back over here for now. Eventually, I'd like to change that picture too, but I got to find the right picture to change it. And then I will. I paid $2 for that picture in Trenton. And I painted it black. And I painted the frame black. And... I just liked it because it was moody and I just added all the black in and then did the frame and it made it really moody. But it's the coloring is what I love. It's not so much the picture. And it turned out nice after I fixed it up a bit. But anyway, so that's back there. And the one Lori gave me is over my sink now. For now, that's where she's going. I walked around and tried places in my bedroom, but I didn't like it as much as I do right here. And she's so pretty, she's such a pretty little girl. Now I have to figure out the marble table. Oh, when I love this, I haven't put my dishes away, I just washed them. Lori knows this is my favorite style of plate. I always look at them. And then of course my beautiful queen bee mug. But um, I love this, cause I have a wood one, but I don't have a marble one. So it's nice to have the marble one. I'm getting too much stuff on my counter though. So I got to stop guys. I have to stop. I think I'll put it with the salt and I have um, different kinds of salt here. I have one for, that I use for like boiling water and stuff and boiling pasta. I have a pepper. This one here is a mixture of dill and sea salt, pink Himalayan salt, nutmeg, and then that. I think I'm gonna do that. This is my sugar bowl. I don't really use sugar, I use sweetener, which is, I know, terrible for me, but I do. But um, yeah, I have to figure out a way not to make this quite as junky. Well, Milana, I'm having my first coffee and while I'm halfway done, just cleaning up a little bit. Thank you very much again. I am closing this video. And if you like this kind of content, please like and subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you on the next one. Getting ready to leave. Loves everybody, have a beautiful day. Thanks a million. Queen Bee, coming from Queen Bee Mama Brooke. Bee loves.